Third down, long yardage, third and 23 following the penalty. Rolovich, four-man rush, steps up, throws long for Lully, has it at midfield. And Lully will score. 78-yard touchdown pass. That's something, Jim, we may see a good bit of because I think that uh, Miami of Ohio will have difficult time running with the University of Hawaii. And Lully wide to the right. Rolovich looking, throws. That's complete to Lully with space. He's at the 10, first down. From the 10 yard line. Rolovich into the corner for Lully. Lully catches it for the touchdown. I speak too soon. This is excellent concentration on the part of Lali because Bowen has a beat on the ball. What he does right here is he goes up for the ball and Lali is behind him. He needed to play his hands and knock the ball out of his hands as it came down because he was beat. Hawaii crowd, but that paled in comparison to what he got from his coach, Terry Hepner, the head coach for Miami, all over his, guard, his uh, offensive lineman. Pass to Lale. Touchdown. One play. 60 yards. And you can see the time that Rolovich had. That was a job. He just laid the ball out there, and Lali went to get it. When you've got somebody that can run like Lali, just like that, you just lay it out there and let him run. 14 touchdown receptions now for Lali. Miami playing without a free safe. First down from the 35. Rolovich looking long. Throws. That is caught by Lali. Another great catch over the shoulder. While Lee just continues to amaze, take a, take a look at this one. Here comes the blitz. Rolovich throws over the middle. Lully at the 15. He's down at the 12. While Lee is one-on-one -on -one to the post. Is the lone setback with Rolovich. First down from the 20. Rolovich, sideline pattern, that's complete to Lully, spins to the inside, gets a shot at the 29-yard line, but falls over the 30 for the first down. Colbert again in motion. Rolovich looking long, throws long up the sideline for Lully. Lully catches it, back pedals inside the 10, stretches to the 7-yard line. You'll see here, this is just a nice job of Nick Rolovich. You go ahead to throw the ball to Lully. When Ashley is, looks like he's covered, go ahead and throw it. Rolovich, first down from the 11. Steps up, throw sideline pattern. That's complete to Lully. Lully out of bounds. On sack Rolovich, a little better pressure for Air Force. Second down and 15. Rolovich looking over the middle. Dancing, dancing, throws. Complete to Lully for the first down. Lully at the 40. Out to the 42. Deflecting the ball. Nice job. Second down and 10. Rolovich tries the other side. Deep to Lully. Has a step. Lully has the ball. Lully has a touchdown. <laughs> 28th career touchdown for Lully. is 15th of this season. Now, the thing that we see from defensive backs all the time, Jim, drives me crazy as a coach, is the defensive backs looking for the ball when they're beaten. They should not look for the ball. They should go to the receiver and try to play his hands. Air Force faking blitz. They do not. Rolovich with time. Steps up in the pocket. Throws. Rifles it across the middle to Lully. He's going to come back to the inside. Rolovich is going to hit him with a strike as he comes back inside right there. Harris in motion. Rolovich with time. Throws. That's complete to Lully. Lully over the 35 stretches for the first down. They have it at the 47 of Air Force. Leading by 10. Rolovich steps up, has all day, throws over the middle, crossing pattern. That's complete to Lully. 20, 10, touchdown. He is now eight catches in this game for 209 yards and two touchdowns. Lally is just too much for everybody. 
And Nick Rolovich throws long. Oh no, here's Lully again. Touchdown. That is a single season record, rather a single game record for Hawaii. 285 yards. Nine receptions, 285 yards, three touchdowns. Rolovich completing 58% of his passes on the season. Third and 10, steps up, and over the middle, he finds the lead. His first catch of the game is for a first down, and Jamara Gilford strips the football. Great play by Gilford. They still have most of the game left to go. Rolovich finds time and finds the lead, who is way faster than Justin Etta. Can Brandon Heaney catch him? Yes. He gives directions to Lalee. Lalee, the third receiver for him. The thumb goes out. Full stride. This is the guy. 6'3", 4.27 in the 40. Can catch everything. So first and 10 from Hawaii's 45. Rolo to Lalee. First down. No disguise. Nothing fancy defensively. Lalia curl. They sit back in a in a zone. Rolovich looking all the way for Lalia, who just beautifully. Oh, what a catch! <laughs> that that's the prettiest 14-yard gain you'll ever see. Guilford on him. Oh, goes right to the ball, and the the ball goes where only Lalia can catch it. But he can only catch it with an acrobatic move. That would have worked in the NFL. It's the first third down conversion for Hawaii on the day. Rolovich to Lee on the post pattern. There's his first touchdown of the day. Go ahead and celebrate. Ashley Lalee takes it in. It's a three touchdown lead for the Warriors. What a terrific career and it continues on for Georgia Southern. First and ten. Lalee gets it and is dragged down at the 11-yard line by Levi Madrietta. Still got 200, almost 200 yards to go for his third straight 500-yard <laughs> game, but he's got time. Boy, no time to throw it, but he gets it off in time, and it is caught by Ashley Lalee. And the only way that that's going to not feel terrible is for this to happen. Lalee is by his man. Gary Croton calls his own place for BYU, but Mike Borich is his offensive coordinator. Rolovich has Lalee all by himself. An 80-yard touchdown for Lalee. Right there. And it's all over, Dean. Well, Lalee will, will make you do that occasionally. He'll confuse you. You know, Lee told us yesterday that he likes to test the cornerbacks early, early. See if he can uh, get by them with, with his speed. But we showed you Rolovich's numbers the last three games. How about this kid? Ashley Lee in the last three games. Eight touchdowns and his average 33 yards per reception. 